understanding where we can effectively leverage uh, money and, 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 and have it uh, stick. And, uh, and so he's one of the preeminent folks here who are doing this uh, in this city at this time. So I'd like to introduce Fred Lewis from Dominion Properties. Good morning. Good morning. As a private developer, we are really so excited to work with the Mayor's Initiative, Vacants to Value. Uh, over the last 10 years, the Dominion Group has renovated and restored over 700 houses, dilapidated uh, and vacant in Baltimore City. We, we've specialized in taking the worst houses on a community-oriented block and rehabilitating those houses and making them some of the best houses in the neighborhood. We've created home ownership. We, we've added houses for affordable renters. Ten years ago, I stood here in this community in Rutland Avenue, Lafayette, uh, and saw a somewhat of a struggling but strong community. I met some of the great homeowners here, Doris Minor Terrell and Donald King, very early on. And we talked about the neighborhood and we talked about what, what the neighborhood needed. What we saw in Blight, we also saw tremendous hope. We saw a lot of will to, to live here and improve the neighborhood. We then ventured 10 years ago to improve this neighborhood, renovating over 20 houses between the 1800 block to the 1600 block of Rutland Avenue and part of Lafayette. I'd like to also recognize that over that time period, we've worked closely with, with Deputy Commissioner Michael Braverman, Evan Helfrick in legal, Jason Hessler, and Eric Booker in code enforcement, who've been tremendously helpful in making really uh, what we've done here happen. Without their support, we wouldn't, it wouldn't, wouldn't have happened. Now, with the strong support of Mayor Stephanie Rollins-Blake, Commissioner Graziano, Deputy Commissioner Braverman, Baltimore Housing and the Vegas Value Program, we are excited to continue our redevelopment efforts here. We expect it to renovate an additional 30 houses in the near future and really believe that the, that the, the neighborhood has a bright future. And we're excited to be part of that bright future. Thank you. Thank you very much, Fred. And uh, now, if, if I could get... Uh,